All right, welcome back. Total OS Today, Total Technology for Beginners and Beyond. I was just about to chill for the evening and watch some Sunday night football, but there is some Linux Mint news. If you are into Linux Mint like I am, there are a couple new releases. Releases, not releases. Releases, Linux Mint 17.1 Rebecca Cinnamon and Linux Mint 0.1 Rebecca Mate have been released. You can get more information here at linuxmint.com. I won't be looking at these. Uh, I have no reason to believe that these will not work terrifically, if not better, than the previous releases. I have tested the latest uh, Cinnamon desktop environment, and out of the two, I would say probably the Cinnamon version is the most important one because it is the most uh, improved, at least from my test to my experience. Uh, Linux Mint Cinnamon is quickly becoming one of my favorites. I still prefer Mate. There's something about the old, you know, GNOME 2 desktop environment that still appeals to me. But Cinnamon is good. It's better, at least in my tests. You can get more information here on the improvements for both Linux Mint Cinnamon and uh, Mate. Make sure you take a look at the desktop, at the system requirements, rather. I will say this. If you have an older computer, I would probably go with the Mate version of Cinnamon, of Linux Mint rather. Uh, if you have a newer computer, then Cinnamon is just fine, but I have noticed uh, that for slower machines, Mate, Mate, Mate is probably the way to go if you have an older uh, machine. Once again, take a look at both. You can take a look at both of these at linuxmint.com. I will have uh, links below in the show notes for both. Uh, Obviously, these two will be on my uh, top 10 Linux distributions for uh, 2014. All right, that's it for this one. Don't forget, there's still time to vote for your best Linux distributions for 2014. The voting will end uh, Friday, November 21st. That's it for this one. Thank you so much for watching and listening. And as always, I will catch all of you guys sometime in the future.